ultimate route to JE success with JE test prep app by Extra Marks, adaptive testing platform, India's top faculty, micro scheduling, live and recording sessions, doubt solving sessions, national level weekly test, analytics and reports. Download the app now. Hello students, welcome to Extra Marks. My name is Deepak Sarma and I'm a mathematics faculty with Extra Marks. I've been a mass mentor to thousands of JE, KVPY and Olympiad aspirants over the past 8 years and we have produced lots of good ranks in the field of JE. So today I'm here to share my experience with all of you guys so that you can perform very well in your JE main examination. So we are right now talking about JE mains 2020. So as we all know, that because of COVID pandemic situation, J men examination have been already postponed for two times. Earlier it was supposed to be held in April, then it was shifted to July. You can see it over here in the public notice of J men's, and then it has been again shifted to September. That means this examination now is going to be conducted from 1st of September to 6th of September, as you can see it over here in the slide. Yes, so today we are going to discuss what things you should be keeping in your mind while preparing for your examination and while writing your examination. So students, now I'll be telling you some of the important points which you should be keeping in your mind while preparing or while studying. Yes, so very first point which you should keep in your mind is going to be nothing but J men syllabus. You should be clear with what topics they are going to ask you guys. Second point which should be clear to you guys is going to be J pattern. And the third point which should be there in your mind, do not pick any of the new topic before 10 to 15 days of your main examination. Then next point which you should keep in your mind is going to be nothing but revise important topics. Yes. And next point is going to analyze yourself. That means you as much mock test as much possible. And for that you can enroll for J men's test series by extra marks and the details are given below in the description. Correct. And one more point which you should keep in your mind. Be healthy and be positive. For that what you should do. Eat properly. Take nutritional food and sleep properly that means at least sleep for six to seven hours and also meditate in between when you are studying you should take regular breaks and in those breaks you can meditate or you can stretch your hands and get relaxed and again go back to your study now two more points you should be keeping in your mind which are going to be helpful for your main examination day first point is going to be nothing but keep all the essential things ready along with that you that means admit card ID proof all these things should be ready with you before one day of your examination and second thing is going to be nothing but you should be reaching to your examination center at least one hour before of your examination and keeping COVID-19 pandemic situation in our mind what you should do you should keep yourself hydrated you should take the food which is going to give you complete glucose and which will give you complete energy to perform very well in this examination for this three hours yes so keep yourself healthy and give your best performance in this examination now so students now i am going to tell you some of the very important points which are going to help you while writing this examination so the very first point which you should keep in your mind when you will reach to your examination hall is going to take a quick review of your paper that means go through it and find out easy medium and difficult question and also read out all the instruction along with that as soon as you will start your paper what you should do you should read out each and every question very properly so you should not perform any mistake and the third point which you will keep in your mind is going to be be positive and be confident why student why because if you will start solving any of the question and you are finding that okay first two questions you are not able to solve then you should not go in any kind of stress you should not get puzzled what you should do you should keep yourself calm and you should move ahead and maybe you will be getting next further questions to be solved very easily further point which you should be keeping in your mind is going to don't waste too much of time on any single question that means max to max you should be solving any of the question within two to three minute and max to max if you are getting five minutes for any question just drop it out that particular moment and go for another question Further, the next point which you should keep in your mind is going to be nothing but solve questions according to your strength. That means if you are good in chemistry, then go for chemistry first. If you are good in maths, go for maths first. Yes, so you should find out all your strengths. You should be working on that. 
next point which you should be keeping in your mind is going to be nothing but don't make random guesses that means do not go for any negative attempt furthermore one more point which you will keep in your mind is going to be keep your rough work very proper that means if you will require any of the data afterwards then it should be there properly visible to you you should not overlap two or three questions yes and one more point yes which you should be keeping in your mind is going to be nothing but time management when we are talking about time management student at least for two hour 30 minutes you will be solving your question paper but in the last 30 minutes what you should do you should check whatever questions you have solved whether you have given the answer you have filled the answers over there in the portal yes or no if you have not done first do it and then in the remaining 15 to 20 minutes you can go for the remaining questions yes and the last but not the least give your 100% be confident enough be calm enough when you are writing this examination that is the key point for succeeding in this examination give your 100% and succeed well in this examination so on this note I would like to thank you all of you and all the very best for J Man 2020 all the very best every one of you for more such videos please like share and subscribe to extra marks test prep youtube channel